My name is Charlie Strauss. I'm 20 years old, sophomore here at Millsaps. I'm from Houston, Texas. Um, I recently declared my major as business administration with a focus in finance. The things I enjoy to do, I love playing sports. Um, I love watching movies, spending time with friends. I'm employed to train, be a personal trainer back home, but here I work in the sports information office. I just do a little bit of office work and then I work scoreboards at games. I'm a business advisor, so I'm an advisor, but I have a business mindset trying to build my own business. Okay, so this is everything you're taking today? Yeah. This is stuff you would take today? Yeah, I'll probably take most of it within the next couple of hours just because I'm about to work out. So when I signed up, I originally just was in it to help myself get products. I had no business mindset at all, and so the business is something pretty recent. For me, Advocare is, it's not only a supplement company, but it's, it's a business. It's allowed me to gain a lot more financial independence from my parents than I thought I would be able to. And so for me, it's become something that could provide income for me no matter what my job is for the rest of my life. My name is Connor Joplin. I'm 20 years old. I am from Dallas, Texas. I don't have another job. My only job is working throughout the year. My name is Trevor King. I am 18 years old. I am from New Orleans, Louisiana. I do have another job. I uh, work in the post office here on Millsaps campus. And I also have another job as a waiter slash bus boy at a, like a little catering place back home. Hey, Connor had an influence on it because he was the one that First told me to take it and then Charlie had another influence because that's when he signed up and when he pushed me to go into it. So I tried it and I really liked it. All right, keep my uh, products up here, my little closet area. Yeah, so say I, um, I have Charlie and Trevor beneath me. It's not, say, a pyramid scheme. Those are illegal. But it is sort of just like any other company. How I mean, you have a CEO, you have executives and whatnot, all the way down to your employees. And the value of products and how things get sold really comes from the bottom and works its way to the top. So just like anything else, we sell products at the bottom level and it floats up to the top. The reason they do it the way they do is because they, it, was, it was created for ordinary people to get out of debt to make an extra income to do something they love. And so they've made a pledge to never sell sell their products in like a GNC store because that would ruin the whole direct sales method. That would put a lot of people out of distributorship or advisorship. Um, and so by giving it to, by giving the the responsibility to just ordinary people who only pay a small fee to become a distributor or get the discount for themselves, it really shows that these people all use the products and that they're the ones that are experiencing the great things that they do. And so some people may see it as it's not as organized or whatnot, but it really just shows that they, they're sticking to their word about making it a direct sales company and that um, the people distributing it use the product, love the product, know all about the product. In the history of Los Angeles. Advocare like, isn't necessarily just for people who play sports or who are trying to like bulk up or lose weight. It's just for like the everyday person who like needs energy or needs to focus better or doesn't get enough vitamins in their daily diet. My mom and, and my younger sister both take Advocare products and, and my sister is an athlete but my mom is not an athlete and um, I know she's really seen great benefits. She's seen her energy levels go up. She doesn't get tired throughout the day anymore. To somebody walking down the hallway, um, what the heck is Advocare? It's that stuff that all the football players are hyped up about. They probably wouldn't know what it was. For most people on this campus or the ones that are interested in the business, it's a huge business opportunity in the sense that um, you can get some financial stability and you don't need to ask your parents for money. It gets you some independence. To me it's just a convenient, tasty way of 
getting my nutrients and energy and being able to concentrate in class when I'm having an off day. A business opportunity where, like Connor said, you can have a financial opportunity, so I don't, you don't have to focus on your parents for giving you money. For me, it's offered a chance to get bigger, stronger, and improve my athletic ability as well as earn income. I find it real easy to stay on top of school work because advocate is a laid back business you can do. You do it on your off time. But I still have time to do my school work and everything, so it really doesn't interfere with anything I do. Well, the business side is it's really, you make your own time constraints. You, you're you going to earn what you put into it. So just as anything else, if you want to spend an hour a week on it, you can spend an hour a week and you can make good money or you can spend, you know, three days on it and make even more money. So it's really whatever, it's really flexible. If you don't have a boss, it's, it's you know, you're doing your own thing. He's a go-getter. He, he, he likes to, I mean, he puts in a lot of time to try and find, I'll say, recruits or prospects to bring in. He's, a, he's an advocate of advocate. Since I'm signed up under him, he contacts me probably every day, asking how it's going. We have the sales lined up. Then uh, we get this person the products and so on. So like he said, he's a go-getter. My biggest goal right now is to be a personal trainer, to work in a gym, maybe own my own gym. And so Advocare is always going to have a, a place in my life.